Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back here to my channel where I play Planet Zoo. My name is Nisse and did you ever have a thought that we have the Timber Wolf in the game and we have the Arctic Wolf in the game? So what if we could get a wolf that was white as the Arctic Wolf but without the pea color on it and then as big as the Timber Wolf? You can, since uh, Havok, Mega Gaming, Rex, and Gap Boy uh, decided to bring in the Tundra Wolf. And the Tundra Wolf does vary a bit in color. The picture I chose here was the darkish color I could find, but some of them are also pure white. Let's jump into the game here and let's see what we got. Now it's feeding time, of course, but it's these beautiful creatures. I do feel all of those I have in here have the same coloration with the darker overcoat. So they're easy to tell apart from the arctic wolf we have here. And you can see here a clear size difference. This is the male, therefore the bigger arctic wolf. And this is the... Um, mill tundra wolf we also have another coloration here which oh that's the timber wolf um so it also appears a tiny bit bigger than the timber wolf but we will take a look at that in Supu there but aren't they just beautiful creatures and kind of a, a big brother to a husky and i love a husky i will never have one because they are too vocal to what my head can take but i love them so much oh it wasn't there there jumping in here and we have it here i do feel like this picture is a little bit off but i do believe it's because the snow which gets in front of it <laughs> is blue I don't think it's the picture of the wolf itself. I do believe it's the blue snow that uh, is a little bit off for me. Uh, they are a least concerned animal, even though the population is the wild is unknown. And to be honest, we don't have that many people up in tundra biomes, so therefore there are probably a lot of people to count them. Um, here you can see they live in Europe and Asia, Russia and Finland. More specifically, I do believe that this is a tiny bit of Norway. And then I hope, with, wish I could my geography, but I don't know what that is. Though, I did, when I searched for the picture, there also come a... Uh, Alaskan tundra wolf up which is another subspecies of the gray wolf as far as I know um, so we have a lot going on here uh, taiga and tundra biome so they do get a little bit of nut snow <laughs> I do expect them to need complete snow though uh, one of them need 1000 162 square meters of land so you, you will need to move a lot a lot um, uh, kind of like a polar bear i love that we have it in the game i love that they have kind of realistic areas but it's just not realistic for your zoo uh, minus 12 to 16 degrees Celsius, and you need great two fence, one meter and 25. That's um, 3.8 feet, I think. Jumping in here, groups from 2 to 12, that's the same as the timber wolf here. Alpha, male, and female, monogamous, confident around humans. Humans should not enter the habitat the males grows to not the length the height 85 centimeters at the shoulder that's two and a half feet i think and the female five centimeters 
small of which are two inch smaller. Uh, live for around 12 years and weigh 45 kilos males and 38 females again double that you have the, the pound they reach sexual maturity at age two and then can reproduce until they die they will give between one and five babies every year and they are pregnant for two months they should be easy to get to reproduce in captivity and jumping in here there are no interspecies enrichment but there are enrichment and they have, they have is that a beaver pool i why can't i pick it up there water pool we have the big bubble machine we have the uh, sprinkle layer, we have the blood scent marker, we have the uh, block of eyes, we have a ducky ball, 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 ducky ball, and then this top group. Food enrichment, we have um, the doggy ball, the bamboo, and then we have the zebra. Only the sink prod, not the pronghorn. It's quite normal actually with mothers where they pick one or the other. Let's look at the beautiful creature. We have one lying down here. Now we are running into a fluff issue with these. And again, fluff doesn't work on Planet Zoo, it's the game, not the mud. Um, but we do still get kind of a lot of detail in uh, So it kind of look realistic even though it is blurry I have beautiful claws I do feel like the wolf claw is almost done Gone uh, Again can be a subspecies thing But normal wolf claws are bigger Beautiful orange eyes that nose are so realistic with all of the can you see every single little bump here again i don't know which resolution you're watching this in but i'm in love with this i want a titty of this I'm, I'm so looking forward to looking at the baby because the adult are so cute and yeah it it brings all of my childhood fantasies to life i want a real size titty of this like massively high titty bear uh, or titty wolf <laughs> uh, which would be amazing yeah i already got big titties and titties everywhere but um no number of teddy bears is too many and uh, yeah i i had especially as a child i have so many wolf and dog and cat teddies especially big cat and wolves and foxes and that kind of teddies um but my dad didn't allow me so i did have to get rid of some of them I don't think that no that was an Indian wolf. We should have some babies somewhere. Tundra baby. Oh, and you are gold marked. Let's look at you. Okay, I would like you to look this way. Th this way. Would you mind looking this way? Okay, we're gonna take you before you run along. They have shorter fur, which I don't know if that's a choice not to make them too blurry or if they actually have that. Um, but I do believe that they would have to survive in the cold, so I, it seems odd to me. But I don't know if the mom would have a, a way of keeping it warm. So cute. I actually think that looking at the face if you just focus on the face here, not the body, just the face. That kind of look like an adult wolf. It doesn't look puppy-like. Actually, actually, I think the mm, adult looks more baby-like than the baby does. But it is good overall. Oh, that's a beautiful tail on the adult. 
but uh, let's see it move because I know that's something some of you want to see uh, and they do swim I do believe all wolves subspecies swim but I'm not sure um, I do feel like this animation is weird this make when the butt is up it made some so much more sense over here we have an adult i'm just saying yes that was the chandra wolf it's easy to tell them apart when they're next to each other but not when they're on their own you see this it it works very good it's i do feel like they would be a tiny bit heavier though being placed a tiny bit lower in the water but that's all so uh, yeah guys you know not all like subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you know the next time i upload a video i really hope to see you again other in the comments below or in the next video bye guys